quite the excursion. It's way out there. In an environment where there was no power, no water, no internet, and no roads. Big Bar, it was more than just a rock slide. It was a, a slice of the cliff. And then all at once, the fish could come and God blocked the river. It'd be very sad to say if there was no more salmon. I don't know what what our people would eat. Two years in a row, we get zero salmon fish. Yeah, there's something wrong. <laughs> there is really something wrong. This slide affects so many different communities. And not just the people, but the wildlife. <laughs> That's two years in a row of virtually zero salmon getting by on populations that in some years would have been up in the millions. There was 22 million fish supposed to be coming up. If we can't harvest salmon, I don't know where we'll be. A few of us from DFO and engineers uh, flew out to site and seen. We realized it was a significant issue. Big Bar, it was a disaster, still a disaster. This is a massive natural landslide that is threatening to wipe out an entire river's population if they don't get it right. It's the opportunity to help, and we don't have to talk about it anymore. How are we going to do this? Let's just do it. Because a cannon that fires fish through a tube and over a dam is absolutely incredible. And this is, a, this is about as important as it gets. There's a lot of people watching. There's a lot of like anticipation. And so the first fish that actually went up the tube was just this incredible sense of relief of like, oh, god damn, it works. 